Um, I've been experimenting for quite a few years in all kinds of different materials, and I just thought it'd be fun to expose some of these materials to you. This is uh, cast acrylic, and I, I enjoyed using the cast acrylic with the rose engine because I can put the rose engine design on the inside and make the outside of the container very smooth. So I made a few of these boxes, and uh, my uh, photography is not nearly as good as John's and Al's. And <laughs> so there's a variety of different colors. The, the cast acrylic is, comes in every kind of color under the sun, and I buy it in a cylinder form, so I don't have to, uh, it, I don't cast it myself or have it. It's not a product that you can make yourself. You have to buy the cast acrylic as opposed to an extruded acrylic, which will uh, melt at a lower temperature and gum up on your tools, but the cast is machinable. <clears throat> so I just threw a few slides together as uh, hopefully some inspiration. This is African blackwood. Uh, I've made an awful lot of spinning tops and combined the threaded box and the spinning top as, a, as one piece, so it's, I guess it would be my signature piece. Uh, threaded spin top boxes. <clears throat> and I thought this event would be after my bone presentation, but I put a few of these in. This, these are medallions, little pendants made from the bone that I'll be talking about tomorrow, turning bone. And I'm passionate about the rose engine, so I've made a lot of these little pendants. I'll be wearing one tomorrow. And this is a bone bracelet. I'm sorry about the, uh, the quality of this. I tried to tweak it a bit, but I couldn't. One of these is made out of bone, and the other one is made out of ivory. I'm wearing the ivory one today, so if anybody wants to see it. I turned each one of these little beads individually, and they turn 90 degrees to each other and nest together. Whoops, too far. This is uh, just two other spin top boxes, threaded boxes. And this is a very tiny one made out of bone, a uh, little tiny spin top box, threaded. That's a dime right there. And this is a picture of my shop when the Mark II was in there. It's always kind of fun to see people's shops. It's not as tidy as uh, a lot of them, but I, did a I had a lot of fun in there. Recently sold this last summer, so I don't have this shop anymore. That's all, short and sweet. <laughs>